Hello everybody, so in today's video, I'm going to show you how to download, install and use replay mod for Minecraft Java in 2025. So let's get started. The first thing you want to do is go to your web browser and I will have links in the description if you need them. But simply go to your search box and search up Modwin, like so. Once it's done, you should see a website called modwin.com. Simply click on the link and you should be on the Modwin homepage. Now, go to the top of the website to discover content and go to mods. Once you're done with that, simply go to search mods and type in replay mod without a space like that and you should see it show up right here. Once you see it, simply click the name and all you have to do once you're on the replay mod page on Modwin, all you have to do here is go to versions and select the game version that you want to play. Now you can do this by filtering them like that and selecting which game version that you want but I'm just going to choose the latest one for this example which is 1.5.4 so simply select the one that you want. So you do this by simply hovering over a version and you'll see a green download button right here. And there you go. Now you have downloaded replay mod to your downloads folder. Now you need fabric to make it run and to get fabric all you have to do is simply go to a new tab the search box and search up fabric minecraft like so and you should see a website called fabricmc.net simply click on the link and click on the blue download button and click on download for windows and now you have the fabric installer as well so now you can close your web browser and you can now open up your downloads folder by opening up your file explorer and like so and if you don't see anything here it's just because you change your directory for your downloads folder for your web browser but if you see your two items here all you have to do is simply double click the fabric installer here in the minecraft version you have to make sure this does match with your replay mod if it does simply do install ok and close once you're done, go to your Minecraft launcher because we need to add our replay mod jar mod file to our Minecraft launcher. The way we do this is simply by going to the .minecraft folder in the Minecraft folder directory. And the way we do this is simply by number one, making sure we do have fabric loader because this does add a new folder called mods. And we can access this folder by simply going to installations, hovering over fabric here, and going to the folder icon. Now you're in the dot .minecraft folder and all you have to do is locate the mods folder, double click the mods folder, go to the downloads folder, select and copy replay mod and click the back to mods on the top left arrow here and click paste. And now you should see one mod, replay mod, in your dot .minecraft folder and mod. Okay, so once you're done with this, simply go Back to your Minecraft launcher, go to play, make sure you have fabric loader here, if you do, click play. Now it's going to download all the files and folders for fabric to run, and then we should be able to start using replay mod. Alrighty, so once we have replay mod open like this, here we can see we have Minecraft, our version, and fabric here, so fabric works. To use replay mod, we need to know two things. Our replay saves will be right here in this button. And to start recording, we have to go to a single player, multiplayer, co on realms. But all you have to do is go, simply go to a world. Here you see a little X. This means no recording. This means record. And if we go to a world, for example, this will automatically start the recording. Like so, here we can see that we are currently recording on the top left. And if I just walk around like this, there you go, we can now stop our recording. We can do this simply by doing escape and pause or stop recording. And if we did this, we can just leave and it says saving, just do done. If you do this, it will delete it. Now you did done, all you have to do is simply go to your replay viewer. And now you have your whatever amount of length of replay you have. So all you have to do here is simply click it and click load. 
here we have our Minecraft character and we've been walking around. So all you have to do here is simply click T and you can bring this back. So for example, if we want to start just recording, if we just want to export all of this, for example, we can just put a keyframe here and we can just throw another one right here so we can just do escape put this back here and if I go here like this it'll just bring me like so like that and there you go so if we go back here and we just simply replay there you go we just go up back and we go from here to here so if you want to export this for example all you want to do is simply click bend the camera path here we can change some settings, we can change how much frame rate we want, and we can change the resolution, we can change bit rate, everything. And all we need to do here is simply once you basically change everything that you want, you can go to render. Although you can't do this just yet, because you need to have FFMPG installed. And the way you do this is very easy. All you have to do is simply click copy to clipboard, that will copy the link. Go to your web browser and you want to do paste by like control V or just pasting it in there. And now we have FFMPG. All we have to do here is simply click the green link and it's going to download this automatically for us. Now, while this downloads, the way you add this to your Minecraft folder, it is quite easy. You just have to go back to the Minecraft folder. You can do this in multiple ways. I'm just going to open up mods directly, but you know how to open this up. You simply have to go to your Minecraft launcher and open this up. You can also open up the re resource pack folder, anything. You just have to go in the .minecraft folder, and this is where you want to paste in the FFMPNG. So, for example, once this has finished downloading, we will be able to copy this from our downloads folder and add it to our Minecraft folder. So, let me show you how to do this. All you have to do is simply go to your downloads folder, you want to copy your ffmpg folder, and then you want to go back to your .minecraft folder, and you want to paste it in. And what you want to do now is simply go and inside the actual folder for that, you want to copy it, and you want to paste it in your .minecraft folder. Now what this does, it just extracts it for you automatically. Like so, there you go. And now we have our unzipped version. So what we can do is simply go back to Minecraft, go back to game, and we can go to our render camera path setting and click render. And now it just rendered. So yeah. Now what we can do, we can go to open video folder. And now we have our video right here. It's a very very small recording but this is how we render and change the camera path for replay mod so yeah it's that easy so if you liked today's video make sure to like and subscribe and see you for the next one bye